this is Kevin Mayo, and today we're drinking Stony Creek Cranky IPA. Stony Creek is down in Brantford, Connecticut, right on the water. They're on the harbor down there. Uh, I think they're actually on a small river. They got a great tasting room. They got a great big huge deck, and this time of year you really want to go sit out there and drink some of their beer. And they make some pretty good beer. This has been getting some good reviews. However, I just saw, supposedly this was canned on 12-8 of 15. So, well, I don't know, that might be some sort of 16, so I can't figure out when it was canned. I'm going to give it a crack and see what we're going. I don't know how it's going to turn out. I've had this beer before, but as always, if you like the reviews, please subscribe. We're always looking for new friends. Go ahead and leave comments because we love talking about beer. Like I said, they got a phenomenal tasting room. If you're ever up in the Connecticut area, you get a chance to stop and see them on a nice sunny day. It's, it's a tough place to beat. It's beautiful. So, this is definitely unfiltered. It looks nice and dark yellow. Cannot hardly see through it. Almost like it was juicy and, in, in you know, like it was pulpy, I guess is the word I'm looking for. We got two and a half fingers. I, I would call it white head. Not bright white, but a nice white head. Not really seeing, there could be some bubbles going up through it. I'm not really seeing much in the way of bubbles. Um, they do call this, what did they say? It's a aggressively laid back beer. It's 6.8% ABV, 68, 68 IBUs. And their website doesn't really tell you too much about the hop profile on it. Let's do the aroma. So you get some sweet malt. Get some pine, get some citrus. Like a little bit of orange juice. Actually, a, a fairly nice smelling IPA. Let's go ahead and give it a taste. So it's a nice solid IPA. I do think it's a little old. Um, I get some sweet orange juice. A hint of pine. It finishes a little bitter, kind of tart almost. But I think this is definitely old. I am not going to score this beer. I think this is a really good beer. I've had it on draft recently, uh, so I would go out and definitely seek it out. I thought it really nailed it when I had it on draft. It was very similar to a Lagunese for Dogfish Height, Dogfish Head 60. A nice solid malt background, and then you give you your pines and your citruses on, on the on the back end of it, so I thought it was a really, really good IPA, and I was really happy with it. And you get hints of it here. Like I said, I'm getting a little bit of caramel, a little bit of orange, just a hint of pine, and it finishes, as I said, kind of tart and bitter, and I think that's probably more due to the age. I think this should finish a little crisper and cleaner otherwise. So, good beer. You guys have tried it. Kind of, I'd like to see what other people think of it. Until next time, keep drinking.